All right, boys and girls, and welcome to our guitar, Conan Gray. This one is called Never Ending Song. All right, interesting, this title here. Uh, yeah, so let's start this. We don't need any capo on this one. We are going clean, so let's take a look at the chords we need. All right, so I believe there are six different chords. Let's start with the B minor, it's a bar chord. So you place the bar here on the second fret and you bar all strings except from the last E here in the bass. So five strings from bottom up and then the rest will be fourth on D, fourth on G and third on B. Then we have the E minor that is open E, second A, second D, open G, open B and open E. Next one is D, so that is open D, second G, third B, and second E. G next, so third on E, second on A, open D, open G, third B, and third E. We also have the C, so third on A, second on D, open G, first B, and open E. And then finally the A minor. So that is open A, second D, second G, first B, and open E. All right, so we'll look at this song, but first we need to learn the strumming pattern that will work for this song, through the entire song there. So B minor will be the first chord, grab that one. So one strumming around will sound like this. All right, so it's down, clap, down, up, clap, up. Down, clap, down, up, clap, up. That's one round. So a couple rounds of it to get the feel for the rhythm. It goes like this. So let's take a look at the verses here. You're gonna play in the same way for both verses here in this song. So you're gonna go with B minor one. B minor one. B and G. One for every one of these chords. Then you continue with B minor one. B minor one. That is one chord progression. Pretty long there. And you're gonna play that for two rounds for both the verses there. So just to summarize this, one string around per chord. It was the B minor, then E minor, then D, then G. And then you start again with B minor, E minor, all these chords, one, and then you end with the D2. There you have one round. Play two rounds of that, and there you have both verses there. Then we have the chorus. All right, so you're gonna play pretty much in the same way for all these choruses. And so you're gonna play the same strumming pattern here, just different chords. Now it's C1, E minor one, D1, and A minor one. So that is the corporation here for the chorus. C, E minor, D, and A minor. One string around per chord. For the first and second chorus, you play that corporation for two rounds. And the last third chorus, you play it for four rounds. But in between there, after the second chorus, about two minutes and 28 seconds into the song, comes a bridge part. So it comes right after the second chorus, and then you play this bridge part, and then you end with the final third chorus. But this bridge part is played with G and D. You play the same strumming pattern here. You're gonna play six rounds of G, and then two rounds of D. So after the second chorus, play this six rounds of G and two of D, and then you go right into the third chorus again, and play that for four rounds, like we said. 
And that wraps it up for Conan Gray's never ending song that actually ended in this way. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. If it was helpful, so yeah, thumb up this and I uh, hope to see you soon guys. Till next time, play tuned.